Since the October 7th Hamas attack, Netanyahu has responded with a widespread bombing campaign in Gaza. Just yesterday, nine Palestinians were killed in a strike near Rafah, six being children. This is anything but going after Hamas. This is a collective punishment of all Palestinians in Gaza. Netanyahu doesn't support the United States' position of a two-state solution for peace. He doesn't respect our urges not to invade Rafah. He disputes what the U.S. and aid groups have said about famine taking over in Gaza, and he launched an attack on Iran after the White House told him not to. If he's not listening to us on matters of international security, how can he be trusted with more offensive weapons? Enough is enough. I support the people of Israel who don't want bombs raining on them from extremists in Gaza, and the hostages must be released. And I also support the Palestinians who deserve human rights and dignity. 35,000 people have been killed and thousands more will die from starvation and disease. We are better than that. So is Israel. I'm not sure Netanyahu is, and that's why I can't vote to provide him with more unconditional offensive weapons today, and I urge a no vote, and I yield back.